Hello everyone, welcome to another Lenny Lamb live stream. My name is Kasia and this is also Kasia. Yeah, hello. My colleague from Lenny Lamb. Today we would like to tell you about our woven wraps. Uh, the topic of the live stream today is very broad, however, we really hope you will be asking questions in the comments uh, and we will do our best to answer them to the best of our knowledge. Yeah, we have already received some questions, so be patient, please. So we answer all of them at the end of our live stream. So don't worry about this. Ramona joined to the... Hello, Ramona. Hello, Ramona. I would say it's great to see you, but uh, the thing is, uh, <laughs> you are seeing us, but we can see you. But still, we are very happy you're with us. Uh, all right, so let's start with um, the division uh, that we made for our woven wraps and carriers. Uh, because uh, very often you don't know what to choose for the first wrap and for the further stages of baby wearing, uh, we decided to uh, make it easier for you and divide our wraps into four groups. Uh, each group has certain characteristics that we'll be talking about. First one is is basic collection, yes? It's uh, called by us internally also Safe Start because it's dedicated mainly for parents who uh, do not have any experience in baby wearing and uh, want to start adventure with, uh, with baby wearing just now. Um, so uh, we created a collection which uh, makes it very, very easy. Uh, it's simple collection with uh, only limited choice of uh, colors of uh, regarding uh, uh, regarding the blend. It's only 100% cotton. Um, we have uh, three main weave type in this collection. It's broken twill, uh, really liked uh, weave type uh, by uh, beginning parents. Uh, also hard and herringbone weave. Uh, here we can see uh, some of the wraps of them. Uh, I will just give some Kasia, so she, so she I can, can also present it to yes, you. she can also present them for you. Uh, here we have our ma uh, our basic broken twill uh, wrap. What is uh, 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 what is uh, special about this wrap? There are two different colors of rails. It makes really easy for a parent who just start to learn how to use how to tie the wrap. What I have in my hand it's a hard width. Uh, it's called by us a little love uh, with type so you can find it under this name on our website and what is really special about this is softness it's really soft it's uh, chosen really often by parents of newborns because it's really cozy and it can be uh, can be used from the very uh, from the very birth of the baby and uh, uh, it can be used for uh, for quite a long time afterwards uh, what we have in this collection, there are low weights, uh, it's, uh, uh, it makes the wraps uh, uh, easy to tie one. Uh, as I mentioned before, it's uh, really, uh, uh, really easy uh, for parents who just begin. And what's also important, maybe not the most important, but also uh, quite important for parents who are not sure if baby wearing is for them, if they will baby wear for a long time, uh, it's collection on the budget. There are really affordable prices for this product because we believe that for the start, when you are quite not sure if you you will use it, if uh, if you uh, if it will be for you and for your baby, you are not so uh, uh, you uh, you don't want to spend a lot of money for the first wrap. For this, time will come afterwards. And for the start, we just propose something on the budget. So our whole basic collection is just uh, just in affordable prices. Okay. Yeah, and afterwards, uh, when you have something from basic collections or you are quite experienced parent in baby wearing, you can choose something quite different. And Kasia will tell about it a oh. little bit. All right, I will gladly talk about it. Uh, the next collection is uh, called Trendy. Uh, this collection uh, gives you the chance to express yourself. Yeah, sorry. Okay, I will help you though. Uh, all of the fabrics that are used for this collection are still 100% cotton. However, uh, as you showed, the basic collection that Kasia presented uh, is 
I wouldn't like to use the word limited, but it's very simple uh, and uh, basic in, uh, in as far as design is concerned. However, uh, our trendy collection uh, already uh, involves more intricate designs, uh, some uh, gradients, uh, like rainbow motifs, uh, melange and uh, other techniques that make it more special. So in this way you can choose the colorway that uh, fits you uh, the best. Uh, th this uh, collection is uh, dedicated for uh, parents who are a little bit more experienced in baby wearing already. However, uh, if you uh, are in love with uh, one of the designs, uh, there's uh, no obstacle for you to use it. Uh, all you need to think of is uh, to choose a wrap that uh, is soft and moldable, uh, so the, uh, the start of the baby wearing adventure is uh, pleasant and simple for you. And what about the blend? Uh, it's only 100% cotton. Okay, we have uh, the answer. Isabel, uh, Isabel asked us, I want to know how to choose my first runner up. And uh, Ina Molda uh, said, Love the wraps from Lenny. We also love the wraps from Lenny. <laughs> I, <laughs> I just wanted uh, to make it clear. <laughs> Uh, because they are really, really fantastic. And uh, regarding the first wrap, I would say that it depends how experienced you are. If you have no experience and it just, uh, uh, just the start, as I told before, the basic collection, so safe start collection, uh, will be, I think, the best choice. What weave type? It's actually uh, up to you. Yeah, because uh, we have parents who just uh, choose broken twill because there's different colors rays, because they claim that it's much easier for them to tie the wrap and they are not uh, pretty sure if they manage to tie the wrap without these different colors. But a lot, a lot of beginning parents say, okay, uh, uh, especially after the meetings with consultants, it doesn't matter so much because I need something cozy, something soft, and then we see that parents prefer the heart or uh, herringbone with. Uh, so for the start, I would recommend to, to look at our basic collection and choose uh, according to your feelings, according to what you like. And uh, it's, uh, it's really also good to touch the wrap because uh, before you decide for them, because uh, for some parents it's, also really important how you feel the wrap yes if it's soft enough if it's cozy enough uh, so yeah for the start i would recommend to see into our basic collection and i'm pretty sure you'll find something there we also have uh, we also have some uh, a vlog regarding this i guess how to choose the the first wrap so we have your contact information under this live stream and we will send you the link so you can, uh, you can uh, see this video and uh, also on the base of this you will get all uh, crucial information to uh, make your choice. Yeah? Okay. That was a thorough answer <laughs> for the question, I believe. Uh, since we are at the point of answering the questions, I was thinking whether we should answer uh, the questions that were left there uh, before the live stream. Uh, Asha, can you read them for us? Can you find them? Okay, I believe I remember uh, one, uh, how weaves are created, I believe, the question was. Uh, yeah. yeah, because uh, all what we are talking about now, it's about the weaves, the plants, uh, how the wrap is created itself, why we, uh, why we divide our collection like this, so yes. Mm -hmm. Regarding okay. how the, the weave itself mm. is created, there was uh, the question from Alexandra as far as yeah. I remember, yeah? Yes. Uh, it was about the weave and... Okay, try to re recall the, yes. the <laughs> questions, maybe Asha will find them in the meantime. Mm -hmm. And how weaves are created? Um, I wish I could give you a very specified answer to this question, however, uh, I'm afraid this would uh, reveal too much of our secret information here at Lenny Lamb. Uh, a lot of it is our know-how and uh, I'm sorry but we, are, we can't tell you too much, however, uh, I'm happy to tell you that we have a team of very talented designers uh, who have worked their way, their way through it and uh, they spent many hours uh, doing many tests on our looms, uh, finding the solutions that would 
uh, best uh, work for our designs. Very often uh, it is the case that we uh, think of certain design uh, and we want to, it to look specifically the way it does when we see it on the screen. Uh, it's not so simple obviously, however uh, our designers work very hard to achieve the goal and uh, we are very happy uh, and we are very lucky to have our looms here so we can uh, check and verify every idea they have on our looms immediately. So we instantly know uh, if it's gonna look well visually and if it's gonna work well technically. Uh, so this is what I can tell you how the weaves are created. Uh, it's a mixture of uh, imagination, talent, hard work, uh, specified know-how and uh, tests on the looms. Yeah, because it's uh, what also is the more uh, important, uh, the weave type in fact uh, is not created on the loom itself. Yes, before this it's created on let's say screen of, mm -hmm. of the computer. Yeah, and afterwards designers just uh, moved design to the looms together with the program. Yeah, so we have to test it. Uh, yes. Because so what seems a good idea sometimes doesn't turn out to be such a great idea in the reality. <laughs> yeah. uh, so this is great that we can uh, test it every time. Uh, I don't know, Asha, did you manage to find the questions? Can you remember mm -hmm. them? Okay, I also remember the question that there was the question of what kind of fabric is uh, um, most suitable for newborn and what kind is mm, for uh, most suitable for toddler one, yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, I think I can try to answer the question. Yeah. Um, it's not a rule. This is what I would like to start with. It's not a rule that one thing is definitely better for a newborn and the other uh, is better for a toddler. It depends. I know you hate this word because it doesn't give you a precise answer, but it really depends. Uh, I can give you a clue. I can tell you what the majority of the parents would prefer uh, from our experience. Uh, so the majority of the parents who, uh, especially the parents who, uh, who are just starting their baby wearing adventure uh, would choose uh, for the newborn uh, blends that are uh, very soft. Uh, obviously 100% uh, cotton is the most basic choice and it's a very good one. The fabric is breathable, natural, so it's perfect for a newborn baby. Uh, however, some blends uh, of silk or linen for the hot climate are also a nice idea. What's very important is to make sure that the wrap is soft and it works easily. Uh, there are wraps that are very thick uh, and they are great. They are really great for toddlers or for parents who are more experienced in baby wearing. However, to my experience, uh, sometimes if a parent wants to use a very thick wrap at the very beginning with a newborn baby, uh, it can discourage uh, him or her from baby wearing. So this is not the best idea perhaps. So make sure it's soft, make sure you like the design, it's also very important, uh, and make sure your baby feels comfortable for it if you want it for a newborn. However, for a toddler, uh, then I would definitely recommend a little bit thicker wraps with greater density uh, and you can also go more crazy with uh, various blends uh, because the baby is bigger, uh, the load is uh, heavier obviously, uh, so the uh, weave doesn't have to be so soft and so moldable anymore, uh, so you can choose whatever you like. Okay, Asha, uh, did you uh, find these yes, questions? Uh, I found out, yes. <laughs> okay, yes. we're happy. Yeah, because <laughs> Kasia did not mention it, but today with us there is Asha on the backstage. Yes, you can <laughs> hear her. <laughs> yeah, I'm here and I have some questions. How are different waves made? Uh, yes, we answered it before. Mm -hmm. uh, do different <coughs> waves have different strands? Oh, oh yeah. Is one weave also. better than another for newborns mm -hmm. or for toddlers? Uh, looking for it's okay. And uh, the next question is about how the sizing works. Okay, and about sizing. So the strength of the weaves. Yeah, and, and what are the uh, advantage advantages of, of different types of mater mm -hmm. materials? Okay, okay. so let's. Uh, I will just like finish the my utterance with the strengths of the band because it actually is a follow up question to what I already answered. Yes, that's true that uh, various weaves have different strengths, uh, and the more loose the weave uh, is, um, hmm. the smaller strength it will have. However, 
uh, I'm not sure if it's the correct phrasing. They're all strong enough. I want to make it clear. All of the weaves that are used for our wraps are strong enough uh, to carry uh, babies uh, up to 20 kilograms without any problem. I think that they are enough to carry a grown babies baby. uh, up to 150 yeah. kilograms. We have fans who wrap their uh, colleagues, so yes, grown ups as because well. Because normally they are tested in this way, yes. That normally during the yeah. test we do not put the weight of 20 kilos, but minimum 150 kilos. So. Exactly. So don't worry, they are all strong enough. Uh, however, obviously, if the blend uh, is uh, more dense, then it gets stronger. So, like, it's a natural uh, consequence uh, of the technique of weaving. So, yes, the answer is yes, however, don't worry, they're all strong enough, so you can choose whatever you like, again. Uh, what was the next question? Regarding sizing. Oh, sizing of the runs. Yeah. Uh, okay, let me tell you the very basic information. Uh, all of uh, the wraps are more or less 60-70 centimeters wide and it's like the constant value for all wrap sizes. Uh, they differ in the length. Uh, the, uh, the most basic and universal length is size 6. Uh, this will fit the majority of silhouettes and sizes. Uh, however, uh, you can choose from five various sizes so everybody will find something for themselves. Uh, size 6 is the most universal, as I mentioned, however, uh, if, you, uh, if you are very tall, uh, above 178 centimeters, more or less, uh, or for tall uh, men as well, especially with you know, broad shoulders, it's very important, uh, I think that the size 7 would already be recommended. Uh, and uh, you would ask uh, if I'm only telling you about two sizes of the wraps, uh, why are there five? Uh, well, the answer is very simple. If you are very, very tiny uh, and or low, uh, you will choose uh, size five. However, uh, the, the size of the person, of the baby wearer, uh, is not the only factor influencing the choice. There are also various types of the wraps. Uh, so there are ties uh, that are used very often by more advanced uh, baby wearing parents uh, which uh, require way more of the wrap so uh, there you go with the sizes 8 and uh, there are ties that require very little wrap and you don't want any excessive wrap uh, to uh, drag uh, on the ground so you will choose the smallest size uh, but I know I went a little bit too far perhaps, but for the beginner, uh, size 6 or uh, alternatively if you are a tall person or if there are two people who will be baby wearing and the other person is very tall, uh, I would recommend size 7. This is how it works. There is uh, another question, do you ship to Norway? Of course! Yes, we do. We ship worldwide, <laughs> yes, so, so you don't can order from yeah. any place in the world. And get your wrap to any place in the world. Yeah, and so it's don't you worry, just contact how, how us. How long does it take to ship to Norway? Two, three days? Um, I think that's together with some procedures. No, uh, I'm, I'm only talking about the shipping uh, time. I think that minimum three working days. Three, three days. days. So it's not long. It's not that long. Yes, you can order right now. Don't worry. <laughs> we will ship to Norway. Mm -hmm. Do we have any other questions? No, okay, so maybe if on we Instagram. Okay. Yeah. Maybe yeah. No, no. Nothing. Okay, so maybe we can just uh, continue with our collection description. I forgot now about because, it. Uh, <laughs> yes. There are still, it's uh, still to have you here. two collections left. Yeah, yeah because it's my turn now. <laughs> <laughs> Finally I would like to say something. Okay, go on. <laughs> Okay, so now my favorite collection, it's fancy one. Yeah, that I have some sample of this. And what is so uh, special about this collection is that we use different kind of blends here. There are limited series in limited quantities. So uh, we just uh, choose the pattern. Uh, we have this pattern on our looms uh, uh, using different blends like, uh, uh, like cotton mixed with uh, Noble yarns, uh, it is silk, merino wool, uh, it's also linen, hemp sometimes. Uh, so there are really something you can choose from. Uh, there are really 
really nice patterns. Uh, Kasia, please uh, help me. <laughs> no uh, uh, These this yarns are really special because uh, uh, we have them from Germany, from Japan, from uh, Italy, from all over the world. Actually, uh, we chose uh, the yarns really carefully and what you should know, it's about all our collections. Uh, all yarns which we use are certified. Uh, we we check carefully what is the source of the yarn. They are certified with Ecotex certification. That means they are 100% uh, uh, safe for the babies, which we use. And uh, Collection Fancy is not exception is this. to this. Yeah, to this, because all yarns uh, used uh, is certified one. Example of Leiden blend. Yeah. Here I have something, our beautiful symphony in, uh, with merino wool. And also some fake uh, folk hearts uh, with Tusa silk. There are only three examples, but on our website you can uh, you can find far more designs. And as I mentioned before, they exist on the website till uh, till this uh, limited series is uh, ended. Why stock last? Yes, exactly. Afterwards, normally we uh, we. We are trying not to come back to this collection. We just come with new ideas, new colorways, and new blends for this. So, uh, so this collection is chosen by people who want to express themselves, like the rap, uh, who treat the rap as a part of fashion, actually. Uh, so, everyone who is looking for something really special, something uh, what would be, uh, what would be really beautiful and expressing themselves we invite to look at our website under fancy collection section okay since you yeah. are already mentioning mm -hmm. our website uh, I was going to uh, tell about it uh, at the end however uh, I'm afraid I might forget <laughs> and the other thing is you already mentioned it so uh, we already discussed three of our four collections. I will discuss the fourth one in a moment. But uh, since you are uh, at your computers or smartphones at the moment, you can have a look at our website uh, because we also try to make it as easy for you as possible. And we divided them with a simple click. You just go to our main website and you will see the pictures with the writings. Fancy, trendy, basic, sorry for the a sequence, it's incorrect. Basic, trendy, fancy and the last one, experimentarium. Uh, and if you go there, you will be able to see all of the designs uh, that are uh, in the collection. So you don't have to look for it on your own. Uh, and uh, I would like to move on to uh, the next collection, which is extremely special. Uh, this is uh, yeah, this is the most unique thing you will ever see in your life. Uh, the, these, this is the collection of uh, wraps uh, which are extremely limited. Uh, we never, uh, we will never weave a given uh, pattern in the given colorway again. Uh, they are always made in a limited number and on each wrap and carrier. But it's very limited numbers. <laughs> yes. Have I mentioned it's limited? Yes, but One I also mentioned regarding One yes, regarding fancy collection that it's limited series, but this is very limited. That means that One. you have. Uh, one of kind of the product. Yes, yes. and uh, in addition, uh, each of the wraps uh, and carriers has a signature uh, on it uh, telling you how many items in this given design were created. So, for example, you uh, receive a wrap, you take a look and you see only 10 of these are in the world. Uh, so, uh, as I said, it's extremely limited. <laughs> uh, and really? uh, <laughs> it is. Uh, and uh, what's also very special about it uh, are the yarns that are used for it. They are very sophisticated. Uh, apart from the yarns that we also use for uh, our fancy collections, such as cashmere, uh, silk, uh, uh, or wool. You will also find some pearl blend here, uh, aloe, uh, and many other more sophisticated, which is more very important uh, for each uh, fabric. There is minimum 70% of uh, the blend in the fabric. So it's very exclusive, uh, something for the lovers of the woven wraps and carriers. Uh, and the designs are really beautiful. 
Okay. Did you mention that it's extremely, extremely limited? I'm not sure. <laughs> it's extremely limited. Yes, it's okay. a fact. All right. Uh, okay, I guess that we just missed one more question. The question yeah. There was a question about this advantages of different yeah. materials. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Asha? I have a question. Hina asked, I use the size S. Is that the size that will fit me in the new coat? In the new coat? Yeah, coat. Hmm, I'm not sure what coat you mean. Um, maybe about our coat. Mm. Yeah? <laughs> oh, they, uh, sorry, uh, they asked the asymmetrical hoodie. Oh! <laughs> uh, okay, the best way to find out uh, what size will fit you the best uh, is to take a look at the sizing table on the website, measure yourself or measure your favorite blouse that fits you best and I believe this is the best way. Uh, it all depends on uh, on the given silhouette. I don't want to tell you 100% that the size will fit you because uh, to my experience also uh, various sizing uh, is a little bit different in various countries. Uh, so uh, we want to make sure that the hoodie fits you well. So just go to our website and you will find the sizing table there. And if you have any problems uh, with it anyway, you can always contact us uh, on Facebook or via email or you can call us and we will gladly help you with this. Yeah. Do we have any other questions? There was the no, one no. that you told no, me. No, uh, I think that okay. we answered uh, all of them. So thank you very much for watching us today. Thank you so much. So if still you have any questions, you can leave them uh, under this uh, live stream and we will answer them in written form. So don't worry, we are still here and we can answer all the next, questions. Next then. live transmission is? Will be? In a week or two weeks time? No, oh, in two weeks time. In two weeks time. Okay, so be with us. Make sure. We will also tell you in advance, but uh, make sure you will be checking. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So thank you very much. Bye. You. Have a great day. Bye.